I know. I just have to post this video even though uh, it's not what I want to be doing or want to be posting for that matter. But uh, those of you that were loyally hanging on for the duration, I just thought I should let you know what's happening. Jet lag, of course. And I came home with two unfinished projects I, I'm trying to finish. Remember that book? Well, I'm trying to get that done. I am still, I'm almost done, but I've worked on it in the plane all the way home, and I've been working on it since I got home. Even more demanding is the video of the cremation. A cremation is about much more than a fire. I mean, that all takes place in a couple of hours. It's all over, right? But there were days of ritual. I even didn't go to the last two days of ritual. Now, upon getting home, I realized there are more rituals go on. It's another month, some people say, before the spirit of that person is definitely ensconced within the ancestral area of the family home. That's what an anthropologist says. Every Balinese has a different story. If you're trying to document and understand what you're seeing, forget it. They don't even. Uh, the priests probably do. So I have a lot of footage of, of rituals, but please don't expect any uh, explanations. Who knows what was happening? It's extremely complicated, and, um, but I think the footage is interesting. So I'm going to divide it within like three or four videos and uh, probably put the first one of those up uh, tomorrow and try to get them all uh, without too big a gap uh, between. So all of you who uh, went on this trip with me, thanks, I'm back and I'm almost unlagged.